Ooh, sun is sunning. <laughs> Hi guys, how you doing? You guys, I am going to dash Amarachi and Elizabeth a lot of money, like money that they will, that will shake, like money they will appreciate, because this work is not easy. Like this work is not easy. So I'm in my sister's house, right? And you know, I don't know if I've talked about this whole thing, but yeah, I'm here to do omugwa for her. Um, she just gave birth and you know, we're back home now. So I'm just, you know, helping her through the whole postpartum process, helping her, you know, with the breastfeeding, with the baby, with everything, waking up at night, all those things. I'm just, you know, basically just helping her because it's not easy. Like she's going through a lot. So it's not easy. However, the work is too much. <laughs> the work is a lot because normal, normally in Nigeria, even when your mom comes for Omogo, you have house helps that are helping her. So she's basically like supervising, you know, the house and all of that. But in this case, it's like you're doing everything. In fact, I pity my sister's husband. He has he has heard me, he has seen me. That's one thing about Canada, Sha. Well, oh, this one is too much. Let me shift back. Uh, yeah, so that's the thing about Canada, Sha. Like, you have to do everything yourself. If you want to pay for help, you will pay through your nose. And according to what I heard, <laughs> even when you pay, it's not that you will pay and they will come and, you know, do everything like the way they do in Nigeria. They have specific things that you are paying for. So, if you pay a cleaner, they will come and clean your house and go. Nothing extra. If you pay a babysitter, they will babysit your the child you paid for and go. No child extra, nothing extra. Okay? But yeah, so far so good. I mean, it, since it's my sister, like, it's a no-brainer. It's almost like I'm doing it for myself but it's not easy. Right now, I have laundry to fold. It's my brother, I know, that washed the clothes, but I want to just quickly fold them because I'm in the kids' room. That's their closet there. So, I, and my sister, she keeps their things like cha 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 and she even puts like trousers and tops together, you know, to make it easy for her and the kids to, to grab something and go. So, I have to figure out how to fold. I don't want to disturb her. She's, she's in the living room and she has visitors. So, I have to figure out how to just pair their clothes so that they can just grab and go. But anyway, that's what I have been up to you guys, it has been so hectic that I haven't even been able to, you know, reply comments or anything. I just post, I just edit video and post and run and go and carry baby. Like, that's how my life has been. But right now, things are getting better. At least her breast milk has come in now. Um, she's feeling better. She's healing better. So, things are going to get better now. So, I think I'll have a, I'll have a little more time on my hands. The kids go to daycare or school. So, um, they're not at home throughout, they're not, ha they're not at home most of the day, so before they come back, I have to quickly just fold their clothes and then go and figure out what they would have as dinner, what the whole house would have as dinner basically, because we've not really had like a proper dinner for everybody, it's mostly everybody just grabs what they want to eat and be going, <laughs> the kids, the kids, this one eats something else, this one eats something else, my sister eats something else, I eat something else, her husband eats something else, and I noticed that uh, me and my brother-in-law, we are very similar in the way we eat, like we just eat standing, we don't we're not here to come and start doing scenario. We just eat standing, we just open the fridge, collect half this, collect quarter this, collect that and eat and be going. That's how he eats. But I want us to have like a proper dinner this night. Um, I brought all her soup. Uh, my sister has had oh this one she rests now. <laughs> so my sister has had um that or her soup. She had it yesterday, but maybe I'll just make it as the general dinner today. But I don't think Kaito likes or has soup. I don't know. He will have to figure it out. Okay, no, no, no. There's Ufaku. Yes, let me go and boil rice. Let me boil rice. Okay, after I fold this clothes, I'll go and boil rice for us to have as dinner. I'll carry you guys along for all of that. But yeah, that's my life in Canada. Okay. But I'm enjoying it. Like, I don't know. I'm, it's stressful. I won't lie. It's stressful. Sometimes at night, I to feel feverish. Like, I'm, like, I'm sick. I used to feel sick at night because of the cold too. Yeah, I think because of the cold. So that's part of why I usually feel sick at night. And sometimes um, the younger one will wake up and be calling her daddy. And I'll be trying to prevent her from going to her daddy. Because I told them, people cannot keep having her as a attache. Because now you have a baby that is going to be a attache too. So I'm trying to detach um, Kosi, that's the second child, from her father. But she likes her father too much. My daddy. My, I'll say, no, it's my daddy. It's not your daddy. <laughs> Me and her will be angry, my daddy, my daddy. So I'm trying to detach her because now that I'm around, it's the best time to try and detach her from them, from him, so that she can sleep throughout the night without him being there. Because sometimes he wants to walk in the night or he wants to read or do something, but she has to, she'll be looking for him. He will not have to carry her and sleep, you know. So I just told him that he should just, when he heard, I guess the night when she was crying, he came to the door. I told him, just go, just go, you know, so that 
she would sleep back. So when she she when uh, she kept crying, I was not tapping her, tapping her, tapping her, tapping her, telling her, you know, that is not around, just sleep, that is not around. So eventually, um, you know, she slept, she slept in the night. No, actually she's eventually she slept, then baby now woke up. So baby's cry woke her up, then you know, the dad has to just carry her. When she now eventually slept, he now brought her to the room to sleep. But you know, so I'm trying to sleep train that one while so that it's, it's, we'll have only one baby disturbing us here. We can't be having one baby and one toddler. But I don't feel but I feel a little bad for her child, because she has been the last born, the baby of the house for a not for a while, child, she's just two. But you know, she's used to her being center, she's used to being center of attention and now if I'm trying to tell her that that's one baby is doing what. But she's very gentle with the baby, she likes baby a lot, she's trying to help, always trying to feed him or cover him or if mommy wants to breastfeed, she wants to sit beside her mother and help to breastfeed. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, I'm happy. My sister is doing well, the baby is doing well. So, like, glory be to God. I'm really, really happy about that. But I've talked too much. Let me start folding these clothes before. Um, I want to watch Real Housewives. Um, let me just quickly fold the clothes and I'll talk to you guys. <laughs> size of this ginger <laughs> is this one normal see the size of this ginger <laughs> and it doesn't even have like i don't even know it's so big this is my hand though see my hand and mind you i have big palms see my hand see the size of this ginger what i just delivered this hey i was supposed to bring out goat's meat though goat's meat i guess I don't know where she even keeps ginger. Let me keep them here till she comes. Because I don't, I don't know where she keeps ginger. I don't even know if it's in the fridge. From the smell, it smells like <laughs> diluted ginger. I don't know about the taste, but it doesn't have a strong smell. Mm. Uh, I the way they were shouting, especially that small one. Mm. <laughs> you know, the thing with Sophia is once Sophia gets the phone, she doesn't want anybody to use it again. Yeah. So I normally call uh, I normally call Elizabeth and Amarachi then Amarachi will give her phone to Sophia while the other ones that we do joint call. Uh, okay. mm. So they're not that small. We'll talk. So if you leave only one phone, Sophia will collect the phone and, and run away with it. Uh, uh, <laughs> you, you, that the phone, she will just use it. Just mm. to take. That's what. Mm. You guys, these chicken nuggets. I don't know if it's supposed to be inside the freezer. I think it's freezer, sha. It's supposed to be freezer. They say 
Preparation instructions heat from frozen air freezer. See, here, are you guys sure I'm not going to Japan and come to this Canada? Because, you know, what I'm seeing is not what I thought. <laughs> but seriously, I'm going to make another video talking about this, right? But what I used to think about Canada is not what I'm seeing, okay? What I used to think about Japan in general is, I am, like, from what I'm seeing, what I'm experiencing, what I'm hearing, is not what I thought. Basically, I won't tell whether it's bad or good, but it's not what I thought. So in a different video, I'm going to tell you guys my thoughts, my honest thoughts, honest, because at least me, I know that I am not Japan to Canada. Okay, at least not anytime soon, right? So I feel like I'm going to be in the best position to give you guys an honest opinion about whether it is worth it or not. Okay, what I like, what I don't like. Okay, yeah, I'm going to make that video. Look out for it. I'm also going to let you guys know how I got my visa and all of that. Yeah, in a different video, but so far so good. Um, my eyes have been opened to a lot. Don't just sit down in Nigeria and be thinking some things. Experience some things for yourself first, even if it's partially like in my case. <laughs> Experience some things for yourself first before you'll be able to judge, you know, and all that. But anyway, let me just take this out. Now that I wash plates, my fingers are so dry. Um, You'll be opening mouth. Can't you play with me, Auntie? Eh? You should tell this child to play with me. See? <laughs> That's how this morning. Sorry, baby. I don't know how to call your mommy now. But he should be hungry, Sha. That's how this morning, after his mom finished feeding him, you know, and I changed his diaper, you know, because he pulled a bit. So I changed the diaper, cleaned him very well, rubbed him cream, everything. Sorry, sir. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Rubbed him cream, everything. Yeah. Rubbed him cream, everything, and I said, Okay, his mom should go and sleep. Let me come here and just keep him awake, play with him some more. That's how I now brought him. He was not looking at me. I was like, Oh, can you see me? Hi, baby. Next thing I saw was <laughs> Next thing, we're gonna open mouth. They look, they, they look for food. Hmm? He can eat. And his mom is doing exclusive, even though you know we did formula feeding for the first few days when she had, her breast milk did not come out. But the moment her breast milk came, we just flung all the bottles away because it's more stressful. The only thing now is that now that my sister is now that he's awake, I have to go and wake my sister up. That's the only thing, or else. But I'm sure she doesn't mind. Yeah, let's go and meet mommy now. She don't want me to 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 to, to gist with you. If I don't carry him to his mom now, I go scream. Yeah, let's go. <coughs> I've gone to give him to his mom and now I don't have anything to do with my life so let me just watch something. Normally, I would have tried to nap but I don't like napping in the afternoon, especially here. Anytime I nap in the afternoon, eh, I don't sleep well at night. It's almost like afternoon here is night in Nigeria. So if I nap, it's like I've slept night sleep. Then trying to sleep in the night is not like napping, you know. So that's why I don't, I don't, I don't nap. I've done it a number of times, like maybe once or twice but uh, it doesn't work for me. If you guys are like me but personally i prefer to wash baby's clothes with my hands okay i noticed that whenever we use washing machine it doesn't wash the 
dirt out of the clothes well, especially especially when there are stains. I know there are ways around it, you know, wash off the stains first and then put the clothes inside the washing machine and stuff like that. But it feels like so much work to me because the baby's clothes are usually very tiny. So which one be all those ones? <laughs> so personally, I prefer to wash to soak the baby's clothes and then wash, especially those particular stains, you know, like pool stains, pee stains, um, spit up stains, you know, when they spit up their food, all those stains. I prefer to soak the clothes for maybe one or two hours and then spot wash the stains and then wash the clothes and just rinse it. If it was in my house where we have both manual and automatic, I can just put the clothes inside the manual and spin it. And then after spinning, I spread. That's after washing it with hand, I rinse and spin and spread. Okay, but here it's just automatic. But I'll still, I still wash with hand. You know, squeeze it and then spread it, and it dries. Okay, and the good thing is that baby has plenty of clothes. Like she has, he has <laughs> a lot of clothes. So even if I didn't wash this one, he still has some clothes to wear. So why can't I take my time and remove the you know, spots and dirt from it. Anyway, um, so yeah, I'm just going to keep this clothes here. I need to go and check on my sister. They are now up. Like, she was up before, but now she's out of the room. They are now in the, in the parlor. So I need to go and check what she's going to eat. Me, I'm not hungry. I've eaten a lot of random nonsense. I'm not hungry, but she needs to eat proper food. So let me go and figure out something for her to eat. Let's go. This is a microwave thing confuses me sometimes. <laughs> like, I won't know what i'm supposed to do first me i'm used to just put popping things on fire and warm let me bring out plates this one he's smiling, he's smiling. He's smiling. Mm. and you won't know what to do wait let me bring my own phone you won't know what to do to use and trigger it like google cloud is it google what they call it google storage now google photos yes Yes, now you just pay now. Yes, now. Ah, about one terabyte. This is not how much. One dollar something. It's very cheap. Oh. Yes, now. Means I want to use food and kill her. I don't know me. Food is my. I don't know if it's, will I say my love language or what. Because I do it to my children. Any small thing, when they cry, they just even to say it. Then once my children cry, I'll say, Are you hungry? <laughs> then once the person be hungry, one is that if I'm sure that it's not food and it's not sleep. And I mean, if it's not food, it's not diaper, then it, 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 it make I know why. So, my only person is cranky, even if, like, now, Cora, if I'm fighting for a toy, have they eaten? So, be like, uh, what was that? Must food be number one? Yes. Oh, yeah, come, 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 rub cream. Come, rub cream. One, two, <laughs> yeah. So, of course, come here, come back here. Mm, you did do that one for. I said, come back here. You did. Mm. Dad, you want me to catch you? Yeah. Uh, let me rub cream first for you. Before your body will dry up. <laughs> they can't see you. <laughs> come back here. Go see. Come back here. Five, four, three, two. Come back here. Come back here. Oh yeah. No, come back here. Dad. Yeah. Dad. Yeah. Mm. Come, come back here. Go see a baby. Hey. 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 Go and bring your diaper. Go and bring one diaper. Are your hands rich? I'll wear your diaper. The diaper even looks like my size. I'll wear your diaper. I should wear your diaper. Come on, wear your diaper. Go sit. Go. Who is laughing with you? Come. Wow. Is this your? Is this for Kosi? It's beautiful. Come on, wear it. Wow! Yeah. Wow! You under your tummy, right? Oh yeah, your top, your top. No, come back here. It's just be 
fucking don't understand. See, he can't do wrong. Yeah, one, one, one down, three, two to go. Come back here. She has left me. I was born yesterday. I've been thinking this day you saw me that I was born. You're not informed. Say, I've done this. I've done this three times. Hmm? Oh, yeah, this top is big for her, but it's cute, Sha. Mm, it looks like she's giving oversized couture. Hmm? Come on, show yourself. Come on, show us your fine outfit. Come now. Wow, say hi. Hi. <laughs> hmm, so. Kaito is, ha is having lessons, so let me just chill for him. But once he's done, he's going to have his own bath. Then after him, I'll bath baby. Then after baby, I'll have my bath. After I have my bath, I'll carry Kosi and Kaito. I will come here and sleep. And that is going to be the end of today. Okay, this is Kaito's nightwear. Let me just keep it aside. Hello? Uh, we have lots of time for you, guys! <laughs> Close your mouth. Mm -hmm. Just close your mouth. Yes, close. Okay. We have lots of you! Hello, we have lots of you time. Oh yeah, we have. Oh yeah, we have. You need a cooker. Hell, you talk for two people. By the way, this is the cream I'm rubbing what? for them. This cream I bought from Nigeria. From Blissy Coconuts. No, we, we got it. We got it. From Blissy Organics. I'm just talking on the microphone. Okay, Kaito. Okay, Kaito. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh yeah, we rock and roll, rock and roll. Hey. Two down, one more to go. <laughs> oh, Bye. Yeah. like the bad guy somehow brother is sleeping peacefully but i went to go and carry him wakey 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 cutie cutie hey you guys i might carry this boy around to nigeria <laughs> i'll carry this boy around to nigeria he's really sleepy oh but you have to have your bath <laughs> instead of brother to wake up they're looking for breast hmm? my own is powdered milk as if, as if it's not air that will come out Boy, I must dream about this boy when I go back. To him. I must dream about him when I go back. Maybe I may hear his voice like. Okay. <laughs> oh, what I see your belly. You don't shop, oh. my picking don't shop. Oh. Hmm? Your mama they try for you. Oh. What is the apple? Hmm? Mm. It's barely look big. You don't shop. That's why he's quiet like this. Although he's a quiet child. child.
Mr. Steal your girl. Everybody hide your wives, hide your girlfriends, hide your daughters. Because somebody is here to steal the show. Hey! Look at this! Hey! I guys see this handsome boy? Can you see this face? <laughs> the groom prize where we go quotes, eh? In fact, the groom prize that we are getting ready to quote. <laughs> Meanwhile, for all the grandmothers there, <laughs> I got you, okay? I got you. I attended the annual. Which one should I use now? I attended the annual Omugwa meeting where they say baby must cover head. Yeah, so I got you, even though we'll still remove it, but just for this for this uh, outfit change, I got you. Make no vex. Before we put from there, I got type. Why are you not covering the boy's head? Canada is very cold. You should leave that boy's head to that <laughs> baby. Ah. I removed it too. We covered him, nurse came and said the house is even too hot and removed layers. Eh? So, for others, I said that boy's head must be covered. I got you for now. I got you for now. So, when we finish snapping picture, then we can revert back to our normal setting. Hey, Mr. Steal, your girl, please. I need my phone, I want to snap him on. What do you think I'm doing just so I can snap a picture? Okay. <coughs> so see that your place should not reach my cam camera. Out. If not, I'll just carry you as a uh, what they call the name. As collateral. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Mr. Steel. Wait, let me come for shadows. <laughs> Let's do a video. Hello. Hello, baby. Yes. Hello, His name is Kobe. Say hi, Kobe. Hi, Kobe. Okay, we're done. Do you want to sleep now? What's the time? Eight thirty. Yeah. Eh. Eh. Me, I want to have my bath now. So. Okay, I need to wash his. Um, this is close I soak because I've noticed that this is zero to three, don't finish. No. Mm. It's not like comp I think just one left or two. So let's not wait till Yeah, I remember I didn't buy so much. Mm. I don't know how big or small baby will be. I think she needs to can actually even go and pick up more. This one they are getting twenty for ten dollars. This one was great, you don't need. The day this boy will Except you don't want to wash. Eh, you just want to use and throw away. <laughs> That's the only reason. For ten dollars, Billy, I would rather do that. Okay, it's true, 20. Twenty. It's true before you wash. Exactly, actually, maybe. Let him come tomorrow. Tell me I should put the branch. Hi, yeah, yeah, Papa. Hey, I'll follow him. Yes. <laughs> Hey.
the money. Money all around. Yeah. Okay, you guys, I am done for the night. I just finished having my bath. Just want to add some lip gloss to my lips, moisturize my lips, then spritz my face again. I do this multiple times a day <laughs> or anytime I remember. And that's it. So, thank you guys so much for watching. That was a day in my life as a postpartum care assistant, <laughs> aka Omugwa Mama. But yeah, um, I enjoyed my day even though it was a little bit stressful but not that bad it's not, it's, not, it's not that bad at least i've seen worse anyway thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video bye